Mach Industries has unveiled a next-generation weapon system that is captivating defense experts worldwide, the Viper drone missile. This innovative platform uniquely combines extended-range precision strike capability, affordability, and frontline versatility, traits rarely found together in current tactical munitions. Inspired by operational lessons from the Ukraine war and the rising demand for autonomous, cost-effective strike tools, the Viper merges the long reach of Atoms, the speed of cruise missiles, and the potent impact of a Hellfire warhead into a compact, vertical takeoff and landing, VTOL, craft. Designed by the California-based Mach Industries, the Viper is a VTOL cruise missile blurring the boundaries between drones and loitering munitions. Capable of hitting targets up to 290 kilometers away with a 10 kilogram warhead, this missile cruises at high subsonic speeds and is optimized for deployment from mobile launchers like HIMARS. Unlike bulkier and pricier missile systems, the Viper minimizes logistical complexity and strategic exposure. Its advanced AI guided navigation, combined with multi frequency radio frequency, RF, tracking, enables effective operation even in environments where GPS signals are jammed or unavailable. Priced below $100,000 per unit, it represents a scalable, expendable precision weapon system ideal for mass production and tactical level engagements. The Viper's creation reflects a clear shift in American military tech toward more autonomous, affordable, and adaptable armaments. Initiated in 2023, Mach Industries swiftly attracted funding from private sources and support from the U.S. Army Applications Laboratory. The missile's first flight in January 2025 validated its design and performance. Since then, the company has rapidly expanded production capacity and infrastructure, embracing an accelerated innovation cycle reminiscent of Ukraine's agile drone warfare programs but calibrated for U.S. industrial and operational standards. The Viper's design benefits directly from real-time feedback from combat operators, sidestepping the drawn-out, multi-year development timelines typical of older missile systems. In comparison to existing loitering munitions like Israel's Hero-120 or Russia's KUBBLA, the Viper offers roughly triple the operational range and significantly faster speed, enabling rapid strikes from safer distances. Its affordability also stands out against costly legacy missiles such as Atoms, which can surpass $1 million per unit. Unlike larger cruise missiles like the Tomahawk, the Viper's vertical launch capability eliminates the need for fixed infrastructure or runways, enhancing tactical flexibility. Historically, it compresses Cold War-era tactical ballistic missile functions into a portable, drone-like platform, advancing the trend of democratizing battlefield firepower for smaller combat units. Strategically, the Viper could reshape combat operations by empowering small teams to execute strikes on critical enemy targets, radar arrays, artillery positions, and supply nodes, without waiting for air support or larger missile systems. This compression of the kill chain accelerates decision-making in strikes under Joint All Domain Command and Control, JADC2, frameworks, enhancing decentralized operations. From a geopolitical viewpoint, the weapon's deployment complicates adversaries' defense calculations and dealers' aggression through uncertainty regarding the timing and source of precision attacks. Its adoption within NATO forces could rapidly expand allied precision strike capacities in contested environments where traditional air superiority is compromised. The Viper drone missile signals a pivotal evolution in how strike power is distributed across modern battlefields. By fusing Atoms range reach, cruise missile velocity, and Hellfire-like lethality in a VTOL, easily deployable form, Mach Industries is not merely reacting to shifting operational demands but actively driving future combat paradigms. The capability for frontline troops to engage targets over 250 kilometers away independently of strategic assets or air support represents a fundamental change in warfare dynamics. Should ongoing trials and deployments proceed as intended, the Viper will likely become a foundational asset in next-generation tactical arsenals, bridging the gap between drone operations and long-range fires with an innovative, smart, lethal, and affordable weapon system.